Hey YouTube, it's the test lead, and today's video is what is IBM's Rational Functional Tester and should you be using it? IBM's Rational Functional Tester, or RFT for short, is part of IBM's test suite, but what is it actually and should you be using it? This video will cover what is IBM RFT, which is Rational Functional Tester, what are the pros and cons of using RFT, and then finally, should you be using RFT? First, what is IBM Rational Functional Tester? The company IBM is in the business of producing hardware, software, and middleware for computers. They also provide hosting and consulting services. IBM also created an automated testing tool called Rational Functional Tester, RFT. It can be used to test many different types of applications, including Java, .NET, Web-based, SAP, Power Builder, and Terminal Emulator-based applications. One big thing about RFT is it requires a paid license to use. There is no free version of this. But with the paid license, you have technical support to help you walk you through any problems that you may incur while using the tool. It can also be integrated with IBM's RQM, Rational Quality Manager, which is the test management solution section of IBM's Rational CLM, which is a collaborative lifecycle management. The tool RQM allows users to create test cases, test suites, as well as test scripts. Integrating this with RFT allows the results to be tracked from each test run in the RQM system. Creating scripts. One key feature about RFT is the script creation process. RFT provides a recording tool so that non-coders can also create scripts. You just press the recorder, do a workflow, and then stop the recorder. And throughout the workflow, you're gonna press on different icons and elements on the UI and then do a search for those different elements. However, if you do have knowledge of coding, you can create your own manual tests to your liking. Now for the pros and cons of Rational Functional Tester. The first pro is you do not have to be a programmer to actually create scripts as I just said. You can just use the recording tool and create automated scripts. Next, the customer support. Many other automation tools does not have a dedicated customer support line at Help Center, the way IBM's RFT does, so definitely take advantage of that. You get execution logs and reports in a format of HTML to show you the results of all the tests that ran. You can integrate with other IBM test suite solutions to store the actual results of every test run you have. It supports multiple programming languages. And finally, it supports many browsers. You can use it on Safari, Internet Explorer, Chrome, and Firefox. Now for the cons. As I said in the beginning, it requires a paid license. There is no free version. So right off the bat, it has a very high entry to start with. You have to invest financially in order to see if this tool would be a good fit for you or not. Next, it uses a lot of system memory when it is running. You will notice when trying to multitask while running a test script and then doing something else that requires a lot of memory, your computer will slow down greatly. Not technical people can create the scripts using the recorded tool, but if you want to modify the scripts, that's where the challenge becomes. Because in order to modify the scripts, you have to actually step into the code, and then that's when non-technical people might get overwhelmed and lost. And now finally, should you be using IBM's Rational Functional Tester? There are two sides to see if you actually should be using this tool. First, you must ask yourself a few questions. One, will non-technical people be creating test scripts? Two, do you already have the IBM RCLM test suite? And will like one seamless flow to integrate all your testing procedures? And finally, can you afford the licenses for each user that's gonna be using this tool? If you answered yes to all three of the previous questions, then you probably should give RFT a try. However, if you had just one no, you might wanna look at other choices you might be better off with one of the open source free alternatives to RFT. Some other alternatives are like Selenium. Selenium is a free open source tool, as I said, so you're saving money instead of buying licenses, you can put the extra money towards getting more developers or more testers for your testing processes. To wrap it up, IBM's Rational Functional Tester is definitely a very powerful tool, but the costly licenses is one of the biggest hurdles for anyone trying to use the tool. If you found this video helpful at all, please like, share, and subscribe. If you want a video just like this, please take care. If you want to see my newest video, please take care. And hey, don't forget to learn something new today.